let us compare the two methods uh, to synthesize nanomaterial. Look at the top-down approach. In top-down approach, initially we have bulk material, then we make this bulk material into slices, we get slice or powder form, and after that we get our desired material, nano material. If it is zero dimension, if it is one dimension, if it is two dimension. Look at the bottom of approach. Bottom of approach basically starts from atom or molecules. When it combine, it make cluster in this is also called agglomeration. And finally, we get our nanomaterial. If it is zero dimension, like nanoparticle, if it is one dimension, like nanofibers, if it is two dimension, like sheets, or if it is three dimensional form, powder form. So, this was the analysis of two uh, methods top down, bottom.